Hey guys, what is up? It's Laura here, back with another video. So I thought I would share the two Aldi finds that I just discovered. So I was on my Instagram Explore page. Technically, I don't even know if this one's new, but you know, I thought I'd share it because it's new to me. So first, I this one I didn't find on my Explore page. This one I just found in store and thought it looked good. But it's the Jar Joy... Florida made hand-picked white chocolate raspberry cheesecake made from scratch ready to eat single serve so they had a chocolate one too but I'm not you know I eat chocolate by itself I don't really eat chocolate with other stuff and then this is why I went into Aldi in the first place so they have two new olive dips they have the dirty olive or the dirty martini olive and then they have this one which sounded absolutely amazing so this one I'm gonna totally butcher like how you pronounce this, but it is the Muffaletta Olive Dip, New Orleans style olive salad with Nouffel Chantel cheese and Cajun spice. It's 70 calories per two tablespoons. Um, you wanna keep this refrigerated. It hasn't been out for too long. It's really cold in Michigan, so. Um, this is what it looks like. I am not really a big olive person. Like, I don't eat olives by themselves because I find that they're, like, really briny. But I have been getting into, like, tapenade and stuff like that. So I was like, you know, it can't be that bad. Plus, I don't know if y'all, like, live in the South or have been to the South. But I've been to, um, a few years back when I was in college still, I went to Louisiana Actually, it was New Orleans, Louisiana. We had like a church conference or something like that. So I was at their theological seminary for like a week. And let me tell you, their downtown area is absolutely beautiful. Their food is amazing. So I was just like, I don't know, it gave me like weird nostalgia. And I was like, I need to like try this. Like regardless of whether or not it's good, I'm going to try it. So yeah, I have these Georgia sourdough artesian everything crackers so i'm gonna try it with that and yeah just keep watching if you want to see my review now go ahead and grab a cracker ah, crap. i don't know whenever i do like taste tests or something like something's breaking something's falling down that's why i don't even bother to edit because like i know i'm not perfect so there's no point in me faking like I am. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. One. That is fire. You definitely taste the Cajun. It's not too spicy at all. But I'm like shook. That tastes exactly... Like, if you were to turn the sauce on the olive burger from Mr. Burger into a dip, that is exactly what it would taste like. And it is amazing. Like you need to get it. Like go to Aldi after this video, drive yourself to there and get you some. It is so good. Okay, honestly, the raspberry is not my favorite. The white chocolate and the cheesecake part of it is really good. Um, But it's definitely not my favorite. So I think I would give it like a 7 out of 10. I am really curious to try the um, Death by Chocolate one. But it's definitely not bad. So yeah, if you like cheesecake, you should definitely pick them up. They're not super expensive and they're literally ready to eat. 